Serialization in Track and Trace is uh, unique in that it's, it, it impacts all aspects of your IT infrastructure from the packaging line all the way through to exchanging data across your, your trade partners as well as your contract manufacturers. As companies move to serialization, they need to think of a lot of things. And it's very common approach to start thinking of the lines and the devices and the vision systems because those are more concrete and physical. We encourage our customers to really look at this from a top-down point of view because decisions that are made today are really going to impact the efficiency by which you can exchange data with your downstream wholesalers or your contract manufacturers. When you start to look at the challenges of delivering thousands of messages on a daily basis, the, the, those challenges have not yet been, been solved in mass. Uh, serialization and track and trace brings a, a unique requirement that companies haven't faced yet today. And a solution like Tracelink has really built their capability from a network perspective, trying to help companies meet that requirement. So at every level, we're interoperable with different governments, with different supply chain partners, with your internal systems and your internal processes. That's a fundamental core capability of Tracelink, is to have interconnectivity and interoperability at every level of the stack. Rather than operating within an independent serialization and track and trace system, Tracelink Solution was really designed to let them continue to operate how they do today within their ERP, within their warehouse management system, that then communicates to Tracelink. Tracelink has developed interfaces with a number of the major ERP systems, a number of the major warehouse management systems, as well as line management systems. And this is all in the spirit of eliminating risk as part of the deployment process because we have pre-built out-of-the-box capability with these third-party systems.